Aware's map navigation tools make it easy for you to zoom in to areas of interest or move the map display. The zoom magnifier works by clicking or click and dragging a box around your area of interest. Zooming out allows you to move back from your map display in small increments. The pan tool allows you to grab and drag the map in any direction. Clicking on the full extent button takes the map back to the fullest possible extent of all currently displayed map layers. The left and right arrows allow you to move back and forth between the views you've selected with the zoom and pan tools. You may also resize the map window itself to make it larger or smaller. This is useful if you need a larger view of your table data, or you want to fill the interface with your map. Add Microsoft's Bing Maps to your map view to get a detailed view of the project area. Turn on the backgrounds under the View menu, go to Bing Maps, and select one of the options there. These background views are non-interactive and only used for visual reference. They can't interact with any of AWARE's analysis or query tools. Often, you'll want to work with only a subset of your data, or require a subset as part of your results. With the map layer selected in the tree view, use the feature selection tools to select a subset of your data. You can click and drag a rectangle, circle, or polygon around the desired set of features. Map features will be highlighted yellow when they are selected. You may also choose to simply click on individual features to select them. Use the Control and Shift keys to modify your selection by adding or removing features respectively. As you select features, you'll notice the summary statistics change to reflect your selection. You can clear all selected features by clicking on the Clear Selected Features button in the toolbar. Map selections are extremely powerful, allowing you to narrow your focus to only those areas important to you or your organization. More advanced selection techniques will be covered in future videos. More information on navigation, Bing Maps, and map selection can be found in the help file.